Hey everybody, this is Buddy. I was uh, asked to do this radio talk show, uh, Dave Scott, spacedoutradio.com, and I went ahead and I did it, but uh, there were so many things that we touched on that I didn't finish the... I just have a weird way of talking. I'll be the first to admit it. I, I start a subject and I don't complete it. I don't get back on track because I'm not using no notes or nothing written out as a storyline or as a something that's showing where I'm going. That's my fault. That's just the way I've always been. But uh, by doing the interview, I opened myself up to not tell everything about the subject. So that's why I want to go ahead and make this real quick and let you know there's a part in there I talked about the fact that I haven't been sick since August the 17th, 2003. And that is a true statement. There's nothing wrong with that statement except the fact that over those years, about three different times, I got almost the flu but I was able to break it off of my body really quickly, really easily. My body just needed rest. And when my body needs rest, I rest. I literally can do nothing for three days. And I'm good at it. <laughs> I'm good at rest and I'm good at listening to my body. But the point I want to say is this. I learned right off the bat when I got with Emily Limley that vitamin C was great. So ever since then I got with her, I always have vitamin C with me. thousand milligrams, the best quality that I can get. And uh, so I'm always dosing on my vitamin C. I'm going to tell you something. If you got a good immune system with vitamin C and the other vitamins, I don't want to go off into everything that I take, but it's it's an assortment of quite a quite a bit of stuff that's vitamins, minerals, and nutrition, nu nu nutrients. But the point is, this is vitamin C. Damn, I'm getting off track again. With my immune system the way it is, I could be around people with Ebola and I won't catch it. All you got to do to stop a goddamn out, out, outbreak of Ebola is give everybody vitamin C and B12 shots. It ain't, it ain't rocket science. They ain't going to tell you this on the mainstream news. But vitamin C is, is, is God's gift for perfect health. Uh, when I go into a hospital and know I'm going to be around people, I take 6,000 milligrams of vitamin C in a 24-hour period and then follow it up the next day with 3,000, then wane back to 1,000. And if I, know I'm, if I know I'm around sick people, I, I, it doesn't hurt you to have that much vitamin C in your system. Look it up. Prove me wrong. Prove me right. I'm going to just tell you it works for me in the damn uh, the life that I live, you know, kind of like proves it out that uh, it ain't fun to be sick. It ain't fun to be crippled. It ain't fun to not have no energy. By the time I get back to Ozark, I've been here three times at the Hardy's. That's three laps. It'll be 60, I'm thinking 62. <laughs> and uh, you know, I, if I see people that say they can't do it. They don't know how they could get their body back in shape. I'm going to tell you something. It ain't nothing to it but to do it. You got to start with step one and go to step three. It takes time. But you ain't got nothing else but time. Your health is more valuable than all the gold that you could accumulate in a lifetime. There's billionaires and millionaires, and I know some of them. That ain't got health. 
when you got your perfect health and you know that you can live the next 10 years, 20 years without being sick, a billionaire can't buy that. All right, I got to go with my hands shaking. <laughs> and I grabbed the camera before I did this lap again because I had to adjust my damn hand. All right, y'all keep coming back. We're going to get this stuff right one day.